Mr. Calvini, we'd like to know why the IBBC, a bank, would be purchasing hundreds of millions of dollars worth of missile guidance and control systems from your company. The IBBC has purchased billions of dollars worth of Silkworm missiles from the People's Republic of China, which they have resold to clients in the Middle East. Contingent upon the missiles being equipped with Vulcan guidance systems. My company is one of only two in the world which produce the Vulcan. Who's the other? Sunai. Ahmed Sunai. Of Turkish Aerotech. But why is the bank committing so much of its capital and resources to the sale of these missiles? It's a test. Small arms are the only weapons used in 99% of the world's conflicts. And no one has the capacity to manufacture them faster and cheaper than China. What Skarsen is attempting to do is to make the IBBC the exclusive broker of Chinese small arms to the third world. And the missile deal is the gateway transaction. You have a billions of dollars invested simply to be a broker. There can't be that much profit for them. No, this is not about making profit from weapon sales. It's about control. Control the flow of weapons, control the conflict. No. No, no, the IBBC is a bank. Their objective isn't to control the conflict. It's to control the debt that the conflict produces. You see, the real value of a conflict, the true value, is in the debt that it creates. You control the debt. You control everything. You find this upsetting, yes? But this is the very essence of the banking industry. To make us all, whether we be nations or individuals, slaves to debt. <laughs>